Hey, folks. Danny right here. Oh, my. I'm in a pickle bad. You ain't gonna believe what I just did, man. Got me thinking, too. I was, uh, whew, worked up a little bit of sweat. I was, uh, I was eating some ice. And I, I was sitting here in my living room eating this ice out of a cup. And I got choked on my ice cube. <sighs> oh, ding, dang. I was flip-flopping around here on the floor. And uh, I laid there and started seeing all these little stuff. Stars and it's like, oh dear God Almighty! Well, maybe if I can just take a deep breath, I can, I can make it till it melts. I was a swallowing and a swallowing and swallowing, and uh, then I start thinking, man. So, ding dang, could you imagine if you was to choke on a on an ice cube? People would not know why you died, cause the ding dang thing's gonna melt. It's gonna, you're gonna be sitting there going. <laughs> they come find you, it's gone. They're gonna think, well, good Lord, this man's done, went and died of natural causes. <sighs> I wonder how many natural causes out there have been because of ice cubes. <laughs> dang, dang. That's when you're in a pickle, man. Well, you know, I never really thought about that. You know, who wants to like choke on a, Ice cube or ice cream or popsicle, I guess ice cream would be, uh, you'd have a little bit of the residuals, big word, uh, left over. But, I don't know. Anyway, um, <clears throat> what I wanted to do, dang, hold on, <coughs> get rid of that ice cube. What I wanted to do was uh, tell you guys what happened to me last night, man. Whoa, you ain't going to believe it. I couldn't believe it. <laughs> got dark, didn't it? <clears throat> oh, ding, dang. Just set it right there. <laughs> well, what happened? It finally happened to Danny Ray, baby. I was abducted by UFOs last night. They, uh, I think that was a UFO. Um, there's uh, some aliens came down and got me, and they, uh, they took me to their spaceship and stuff, and yeah, I, yeah. You won't believe it. I could actually understand what they said. They had this little like, hello, we came to visit your planet. You know, stuff like that. And I understood. They said, hey, we came to visit your planet and we're going to take you with us and uh, we're going to uh, see what earthlings are really all about. And uh, they was going to keep me, man. I, I was looking forward to it. I thought, that's kind of cool, you know, get to stay up there with, or down. I don't know where they went. We got in their little capsule ship. I don't know what it's called, but anyway, we got in there. It was pretty cool. And their button, they had these little buttons. I was pushing all these little buttons, and I, I asked them if I could fly the, the UFO. And uh, they, uh, they started talking a funky language into each other, like, <laughs> And uh, they brought me back. <sighs> Just wanted to fly the ding dang thing. Had a little bitty like steering wheel looking thing there, for a little bitty, little bitty thing like this. And I was just uh, trying to play with it, and they wouldn't let me play with it. And then I went, I asked where the potty was, and man, I, I went and used the bathroom, you know, and the ding dang thing. Well, guess what? In their bathroom, I don't know what it was, but I heard the, uh, I heard the craft kind of just shut down. So I don't, I, I don't know. Could have peed in their gas tank. I don't know. I wonder where they fill up with fuel. Hm. I didn't get to ask them. Dang, dang it. Well, anyway, anyway, yeah, I was finally abducted. I was really looking forward to the time off work, get a little vacation, you know, and <sighs> well, well, I didn't get it. They brought me back. I don't know why they bring me back. Why the heck would they bring Danny Ray back? <laughs> well, I guess uh, really I didn't have a whole lot to say to you. Uh, I did. I will say this. There's times whenever I'm doing Danny, Danny Ray, <laughs> doing Danny Ray stuff, 
that I think, man, you know, I don't even know if it's worth the effort. But then uh, something every ding dang time happens and it just sets me back on fire. This time was a phone call from a guy. I got a, uh, uh, he's a, I guess you'd call him an extended family member. He's a boyfriend of my ex-wife. His name's Bruce. Hi, Bruce. Uh, he called me and said that he uh, loved what I was doing, man. He loved Danny Ray and all the wisdom and how smart I am. And he's kind of jealous of how ding dang good looking I am. Well, I know that. But we all have our problems. <laughs> so, well, I don't know. Like I said, I just haven't done a video in a while. And I about died right here in my living room, choking on an ice cube. And I just wanted to say I love you guys. And. Thanks for watching.